Hello everyone, this is Nurse B with another episode of Buzzing with the B. October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, so I'm here to talk to you about breast cancer awareness. The reason why I want to talk to you about that is because my mother was diagnosed with breast cancer in 1991, and she died from breast cancer in 1995. Prior to her death, her sister had told me that she had been diagnosed with breast cancer, and the only reason why she went to the doctor was because my mother had breast cancer. So today, I am pinked out, and I'm pinked out in memory of my mother and all the other people in my family and your family who are breast cancer survivors or who has lost their life to breast cancer. For breast cancer awareness, there are three things we should do. Get a monthly self-breast examination. For premenopausal women, you need to do that 14 days before your period. For postmenopausal women, you pick one day of the month and use that date each month. For example, if you pick the 15th, then October 15th is when you will do it. Uh, November 15th when you will do it. The second thing you need to do is have a clinical breast exam every year by your doctor. Most of us go and have a yearly physical exam, and during that time period, you can get your yearly breast exam. This is a more thorough examination because sometimes women may not be doing their uh, exam um, exactly right or not reaching all areas that they need to uh, examine. And for women over 40, beginning in, at 40 to 45 years of age, you need to start having a mammogram. Uh, the mammogram is a non-invasive procedure, meaning they don't have to open you up, cut you, or anything like that. You just go in there and you take a picture. Now, it is a little bit uncomfortable when you do a mammogram, but that's over in, what, five seconds? So, five seconds is not a lot to pay for saving your life. I may make a difference in your life by just asking that one question. Did you get your mammogram? So, I want you to ask all the women in your family, whether you are male or a female listening to this, you still have women in your family. So ask your mother, ask your wife, your girlfriend, your sister, your aunt, your daughter, have you had a mammogram this year? If she has not, then you need to talk to her about getting one. The reason why I'm wearing this rose color is because I want you to include two other things in your breast cancer awareness. The first thing is just to know your family history. As you can see, I had two uh, immediate family members, direct family members that had breast cancer. What I didn't know at that time that we had had another person in our family, my mother's first cousin that had died from breast cancer. When she died, I was a child, so all I heard was that she had a brain tumor. But what she really had was metastatic breast cancer. It's so important that you know your history. The other reason why I'm wearing this rose is because breast cancer does not end in October. I am going out to vote today for breast cancer awareness because I want you to be able to get a mammogram if you need to because Affordable Care Act allows you to have a yearly physical and a mammogram. And I want you to be able to go to the doctor and receive care if you should be diagnosed with a breast cancer because at that point you will have a pre-existing condition and you may not be able to get insurance. So I'm going out to vote for you and take breast cancer awareness one step further. I want you to do the same thing too. Text me that I voted for pre-existing condition. Let's go. I want to thank you for joining with me on another episode of Buzzing with the Bee. Be, be sure to like, share, and subscribe.
So click on the little bell so that you will get notifications of any future vlogs that I post. Visit my webpage, nurse-b.com, uh, for all my vlogs and to uh, just share comments or your ideas of topics that you would like me to discuss. I will be sure to get back with you. Thank you.